So creating an app with Anthropic Claude is very easy. Just pop along to the Claude.ai site and sign up for an account or use your own existing account. There are free plans available. Once you're there, you can just check your models and add in your prompt for the app you want. I'm asking for a colorful, stylish to-do list. You can choose from a, a limited amount of models to, to create your app. Once you're happy with the prompt you've put in or typed in, you just hit the Go button and there it goes. Now on the right hand side what you're seeing is the AI actually writing the code in front of you live. It's quite disconcerting at first to see how fast it moves but it's a, it's a function, it's a feature I should say of the AI that it just runs like that. Very easy. And then you just wait and there it is on the right. My to-do list complete with all the functionality I asked for with priority levels overdue tracking and and deferment so I can add a task here uh, very simply and easily and as you can see within less than a minute even with my edit it was done and I get a fully featured app it's not a, a trivial piece of code it's it's a small app but it's certainly fully functional with high priorities and dates and all of that kind of cool stuff and it's quite pretty too if you look at the uh, the design now one of the um, most interesting things about the Claude uh, offering as compared to say ChatGPT is you get this very very nice publish button here at the top right and once you press that you have the ability to publish the app to a URL as you can see the URL it can be given to anybody and you can unpublish if you want to but once the URL is live then that app becomes available to the world and of course it becomes available to you at the same time so if I copy the link here and then I can just open a new window and paste the link in and there's my app ready to use now of course there are things you don't get with this kind of browser functionality you don't get account management or cross device persistence or any of that kind of stuff you just get a basic app with limited browser storage for your data but even so for something simple this is a perfect way to enjoy the power of coding by typing.